Hey guys, it's your host, Homeless Faggotron here, and I'm here to show you a new episode. Oh baby, yes I'm back. <laughs> I couldn't figure out if I wanted to clap or what the fuck ever. I'm trying to hype up this video. Now before we get into this episode of NGU Talk Show 7, or whatever the hell I'm going to name this one. I didn't even name the last one correctly, but you know what, fuck it. Yeah, I, I cuss, by the way. Alright, this is family-friendly content for your f neighborhood friendly killer clowns, okay? If you're not one of us, get the fuck out. If you are a snowflake, or... I don't even know, like, like even using the terminology of snowflake, because everybody uses it. I need to make my own. Alright, trash can. If you're a trash can, get the fuck out. I don't need trash. I got enough trash. And actually, speaking of trash... If you're wondering why I have all this trash here, I'll get to that in a second. Sorry for all the split cuts. I just keep fucking this up, man. God. And by the way, I'm tired as fuck. I haven't slept. I've just been having a real bad time with my depression. I'll get into that later. But I'm, I'm trying to overcome it. I'm working. I'm working on it. Alrighty, guys. Homeless Faggotron here, and I'm going to give you the latest news. So, the reason why I uh, uploaded the video in March, even though I actually made it in January, the last video I did, Talk Show 6, for this podcast, talk show, whatever the fuck you want to call it, is because I, I didn't want the attention, you know, oh, the boy cries wolf, or, oh, please look at me, I'm so sad, I'm such a fucking victim, blah, 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 I didn't want that. The thing is, I, I wanted to show people that they're not alone, you know, because I, that's how I felt, and that's still how I feel, but I understand there's people that love me and care about me, and these are just, like, personal things I've just been fighting with, and it's really hard to strain up the right words to be able to explain what I've gone through. Like, I've been through so fucking much, and it just crumbled me. So, getting into this, since now we got that covered, the reason why there's so much trash is because I'm trying to prove to you guys, I don't necessarily have to, but I just want to anyways, because I'll do what the fuck I want when I want, this is my channel, enjoy it. And I want to prove to you guys that I am keeping my word, that I am overcoming this. I mean, it is kind of weird having a whole bunch of pizza boxes of trash and a fucking hairbrush stuck in your hair, but you know what? Homeless Faggotron is your friendly neighborhood clown, and I love you! But yeah, back to the actual serious shit. Um, fuck, I lost the thought. Give me a second. But back to the serious stuff. I am trying to overcome it. So, all this trash... It doesn't just represent. This is all the trash that's been in my apartment. Just lying around. And I just cleaned it up. I'm deep cleaning the entire crib. It's under full-on construction. So right now, I'm kind of making this as the talk show area office, where the fuck I'm going to call it. But it's going to be in my bedroom. I got a whole bunch of ideas. And I want to make a whole bunch of Easter eggs. And oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. And as you can tell from my last video, I am more definitely happy. I don't even know if that was a real sentence. Let's go with it. Let's go with it. So, with this thought, train of thoughts, thought of thoughts, food of thoughts, how I actually created this transition, or how I made this transition from going from that super depressed, I don't give a shit anymore, I just want to die, just fucking kill me, I want to put a barrel over my chin and just fucking explode, fucking hang me, overdose me, you know, all that fucking terrible shit, to... Me being kind of like semi-happy, I mean, you can kind of tell I'm a little bit more excited in this video than I was in the other one. And how I did that was by push-ups. I literally, wait, hold on, I'll be right back. Alright, alright, I don't know how well you guys can see this, but I've been recording all of my push-ups that I've been doing every single day. And so far... I am on day 25, and I've done over 1,100 push-ups so far. 
And to be completely honest with you guys, this right here is, I, I would have to say, doing push-ups every single day is what really pushed me, really moved me to get me going. And it might sound strange, but I mean, how I felt when I made that first video a couple months ago, I was just in a very, very dark place. Every single plan I had for NGU fell through. I, I just felt like a completely failure. I just felt like I was worthless and nothing. But I wanted to try. I love making videos. Videos is my dream. I've always been making videos. I've been making videos since 2009. Super crazy, but that'll probably be a later on video. But, like seriously, I was in such a dark place, it was to the point where it was hard to get out of bed. You know, and that might sound like a pussy thing to do, it's just I didn't want to live anymore. Like, I didn't brush my teeth, I didn't shower, I looked like fucking terrible, like, you know, homeless faggotron. Right here. But, like, it was hard, like, I didn't want to do anything, and I just went into this repetitive recycle of depression. I'm tired because I'm depressed, but I'm depressed because I'm tired. I didn't eat. I would sleep, uh, like, I could sleep 36 hours, and I'll be, like, up for three days. Like, I was basically a meth head on depression. That, that, that's probably, like, the best way to describe it, but I've never done meth, so I, I can't particularly, you know, uh, back that up 100%. I can't guarantee it. No way. But, um, what I did is I started playing video games. And I'll be making video game videos later on. Oh, that's kind of fun to say. Video game video. Video game video. Game video game. Video game video game video game. <laughs> I sound like Lil Wayne. Video game video game video game. Now, now I sound like one of those mumble rappers. <laughs> oh no, look at there. It's a one hit single. Man, I'm gonna make millions off of that fucking record. <laughs> I will go into those later on. But, uh, how everything started is I started playing video games, and every single time I died, I would do a push up. And I went from doing one push up to five push ups to ten push ups, and now I'm all the way doing 25 push ups a single set. I'm really proud of myself, and I feel like I'm finally coming out of the closet. Homeless Fagatron here for you. And I really, I, I know right now, since I'm starting out, I'm overcoming my depression, that this is probably going to be a fucking cringy video. I'm okay with that. I mean, at least I don't have to deal with trash cans. I'm okay with trash. You know, I love trash. But fuck. Trash can trash cans I just can't stand because they're so fake. They're all empty inside. At least, you know, trash is like a human being. You know they went through some shit. They've done some mistakes, but you know what? They're fucking there. They're right there and they got this little safety net to help you out too. Everything's just gonna be falling over now. Ow shit, dude, this fucking hairbrush is pulling my hair. Gotta do it for the vines, bro. Do it for the vines. Well, anyways, beside Moving on, besides the fact that this is a terrible video, but I do hope you guys are enjoying it. And this is basically just a documentary of my life and what's going on. And right now, I guess I'm totally comfortable with summing it up like this but I hope you get the message I'm cleaning the trash out I'm gonna be cleaning up this apartment getting everything set up and I'm gonna be producing a lot more I love you guys uh, sorry that I'm cutting this so uh, maybe a little bit too short I have no idea but I think that's all the time we have today it's uh it really feels good to get back into this, you know. Like to be completely honest with you guys, I this might sound corny or whatever, but fuck it, it's the truth. Like I I feel like I have like this little spark inside. You know? 
and I can feel my spark like it, like it's glowing like this is what I'm meant to do like I can literally say for once in a long time I'm actually truly happy you know I'm getting there it's gonna take some time and I'm trying to get used to being in front of the camera again and just be able to come with sentences <laughs> shit I'm so tired you know what fuck this I'm just gonna take this to the fucking dump and uh, get this shit out of my hair fucking go take a shower and go to bed love y'all toodles